was a tougher test. The reigning European champions and the 2019 World Cup finalists, the Netherlands, are the team that they face tonight. It's a team Serena knows very well. She managed them to that famous Euros win back in 2017. And against one of the top teams in Europe, this will be a great chance to see exactly where England are. Kickoff is just 45 minutes away. Mika Martins as well, moved from Barcelona to, to PSG. How much of a danger will she be tonight? Huge threat. Uh, Lika Martins has been, you know, a threat for many, many years uh, for Barcelona and for Netherlands. Um, you know, we saw uh, it, in the Champions League final against Chelsea a few years ago how much of a threat she was and she's continued to be. I think this is going to be a big test uh, for both Minnie Bright and Alex Green. We won or lost the midfield. If they can get the ball to their forwards and cause us problems, then we're going to have them. And if we can do the same, so we can cause them problems. So that's what I'm hoping will happen for us tonight. We can cause them problems. Why don't we hand you over to your team then, Serena Wiegmann, she's only got two games left ahead of the Euros. Tonight her opposition is a team she knows better than most. Serena Wiegmann facing the nation of her birthplace and a nation whom she led to her first international title and on home soil. And during Wiegmann's time in charge of the Netherlands, one of her core players was midfielder and captain Sherida Spitzer, whose first appearance for the Netherlands was in 2006 against England. And now, all these years later, is presented with a record 200th cap for her country and flowers from her former manager. A lovely touch in there in the crowd, her wife, Jolene. Will Mary Earps get more of a test than she's had in her time on already? Bronze, the new Barcelona player, playing against the former Barcelona player only recently, and Lika Martins has now joined PSG. Here is Spitzer. Wolves Broad, who's allowed to turn. The Wolfsburg player and a nice touch. Walsh. Looking for Kelly, cut out by Janssen. How do you feel about this one that is going to be an entertaining evening? Janssen. To Spitzer. Martins, looking for a clever ball inside. Kelly. What about trying to hook that over? Now on. Kirby. Freak. Given away by Williamson. In a dangerous position as well. Martins sends it in Ward. First degree. And remember, VAR in operation. Janssen. Spitzer is one of those appealing. 80 caps in it, Bernstein. Martins, Rawd, Martins, good spell this for the Netherlands, Martins, Bernstein's in there again, and I think she caught the goalkeeper in the process, and that will be a free kick to England, but the Dutch causing problems, hopefully Mary Earps is okay here. The Dutch definitely causing problems there. And de Graaf, one of the main dangers. Is the corner from Spitzer. Helped on and helped in. And it had to be Lika Martins. One of the Dutch's star players. But they all surround Spitzer on her 200th appearance for a country.
They enjoyed that goal, the Netherlands, and in front, and their threat from set pieces playing out. A brilliant delivery from Spitzer on her 200th cap, and an even better header from Lika Martins. She's not necessarily someone that you'd expect to be getting on the end of them, but it's a brilliant header, and leaves Mary Ertz with absolutely no chance. Frustrating for England because it was an un positive play. Combining well again on this right side. Just needed the forward to get across that near post. Martins plays it through. Bernstein has got the legs to get away. It's very good cover for Rachel Daly. And had to. Brilliant cover from Rachel Daly. You look how much ground she's got to make up. Bernstein's incredible. Finding that space briefly but quickly snuffed out. Kelly wins the corner, so can England pose a problem from a corner? Luka Martins already has. Funny enough, that sort of technique. Spitzer's done well. Good tackle from Williamson. This is a sweeping move from the Dutch. Martins, Bernstein, trying to help it on. It's going to be a corner. Good move that from the Dutch. A brilliant move from the Dutch. Now on. Martins is picking up some very positions. They've scored in the World Cup against Italy. Defender in a set piece called for problems. And Rush may have a problem here because Lika Martins is down and she got on the score sheet in this game. The 2017 World Player of the Year. Martins has struggled with injury this season at Barcelona. She's missed a considerable amount of the season. So she won't want to be picking up a knock at this point, heading into a European Championship. So hopefully for them, just a soft tissue knock and something that a little bit of, a little, nice little ice bag will do the job. Of course, the Chelsea defence, all sorts of problems in the 2021 Champions League final, but wasn't able to play a full part for Barcelona in there. In this current campaign where they lost in the final to Lyon, and now she's joined Lyon's rivals in France, PSG. Defending by Janssen. Martins. And Bronze not allowing her to turn. It is well in the end. Rod Martins. Trying to play it first time to Bernstein. A half time, a very competitive first half in which the Dutch took the lead. Lika Martins scoring a header from Sharida Spitzer's corner. But England got themselves level through Lucy Bronze, whose cross became a shot that sailed over the goalkeeper and made it 1 1. Martins, the other player to go off, the goal scorer for the Netherlands, who was down briefly in that first half. Siobhan, what are you expecting in this second half? More of the same, I hope. More shots on goal.